Tonight, the first attempt ever to defend against a threat that is out of this world, an asteroid. CBS 2's Vanessa Murdoch reports on NASA's DART mission. The sky seemed to ignite in February of 2013 as the Chelyabinsk meteor careened toward Earth. A shockwave shattered windows, injuring more than a thousand people. The mother rock of this meteor, a near Earth asteroid about 20 meters wide. We're, we're constantly getting hit by little meteorites, but we know that there are bigger ones out there. Lori Glaze, director of NASA's Planetary Science Division, says that's why NASA is preparing now for the future when an asteroid does threaten life on Earth and we need to defend our planet. We want to live, no? We don't want to die. Tonight, the DART mission rockets into outer space. DART stands for Double Asteroid Redirection Test. Using solar power for propulsion, 10 months from now, NASA's DART will be six and a half million miles away and within striking distance of a near Earth double asteroid. Didymos, the big one, and Dimorphos, the little one, or moonlit. DART will be ramming into Dimorphos in hopes of moving it. The asteroid we're trying to hit is about the size of a football stadium and we're going to try and hit it with something the size of a refrigerator. DART won't even have eyes on Dimorphos until it's about an hour away from impact. It'll show up as one pixel in the camera. The spacecraft will start snapping pics of its target and navigate without human intervention. Figure out what's the best angle to hit that asteroid and get our best momentum transfer. That's crazy. <laughs> That's amazing that we got that much advancement in science we could really come a long way. I wonder, could the chunks of it after hitting it hit the Earth, though? Could redirecting send the asteroid in the wrong direction? We asked the American Museum of Natural History's curator of meteorites, Denton Abel. 0. 0.000. <laughs> this is rocket science. We know these things hit the Earth, and we need to learn how to deflect them, especially big ones. Thankfully, scientists know of no big ones heading our way. So everyone be calm. NASA is ready to launch the future of our planetary defense. From the Upper West Side, Vanessa Murdoch, CBS 2 News. Refrigerator hitting a football field. It's supposed to move it, I know. right? Hopefully it's like a double wide refrigerator. Yeah. <laughs> That's right, one of those. So you might be wondering why NASA doesn't just blow up the asteroid. Great question, right? Glaze says it's the one thing that you don't want to do. Instead of one big asteroid hurtling toward Earth, you'll end up with thousands. Mm -hmm. And as for DART, it'll launch from California into space on a SpaceX Falcon 9 rocket. It's like playing a video game. Yeah. That's all. Yeah, just do the little toggle thing. Joystick. Joystick. That's yeah. <laughs>